guys, it's Funny Gamer here, and today I'm back with another Among Us video. And in this video, I will be telling you guys um, some update ideas I have and some updates that I'd like to see in Among Us. And none of these are confirmed. These are just some cool things that I thought that would be nice to have in Among Us. So yeah, anyways, I hope you guys enjoy. Okay, so for the first update I'd like to see is mines. Um, so pretty much when I say mines, I don't need, mean mining. I mean like placing explosives on the ground. So right now there's only one way to kill a crewmate as an imposter, which you just go up to them and kill them. But what if there was a second button that said mine and you could place down a small mine and if the crewmate walked over it, they'd explode and die. So you wouldn't have to actually be beside the crewmate to kill them. You just have to place it down. So pretty much you could, um, let's find someone. So let's say this person is here, and then I place down a mine here, and they walk on it, they would die. And then, so yeah, I just thought it'd be a cool idea, because it could be used, like, strategically um, for imposters so they don't actually have to be beside the person but they can still be seen placing the mine um, so yeah so it's not too overpowered but I think it's still a cool feature that could be added um, but yeah and there would be some limitations to this feature like in certain rooms you couldn't place it like in reactor you can just place it and start a sabotage so you couldn't place in like at a doorway um you'd only be able to place it like in some areas in some rooms to make it not too overpowered but yeah so that is the mine just a cool little feature that i thought would be um, a nice add-on for an imposter to make the game more strategic and then you'd always have to watch out for mines as a crewmate. Now the second feature I think could be that could be added to Among Us which I think is really cool is another form of customization. So right now um, we have the color, the hat, the pet, and the skin. So, like, you can change your skin, your pet, your hat, or your color. But I was thinking of a fifth one where you could change a mount. So, pretty much there would be, like, things that you could um, go around in. Like, you could ride a UFO around or a hoverboard. And these wouldn't actually um, increase your movement or anything. They'd just be visual. So, like... You could buy like a mount pack and then um, they're just visual like a pet, a hat or a skin. So they don't actually help you. They just look cool. And like there could be like horses maybe. But yeah, so I think that would be a cool idea. Just another form of customization um, that could really make your character look cool. Now, the next thing that they could add to the game is a new map. So, right now, there's three maps. Um, there is um, Polis, there's the Skeeld, and there's Myra HQ. And these maps are really good, but it would be cool if they added a fourth map that maybe had, like, I was thinking maybe it's underground. And a cool thing they could do is instead of, right now, all of the maps are only one floor, they could have a map that was actually two floors. So there's like the lower floor and the upper floor or even more. And there might be like elevators or stairs. But I think it would be cool with like several floors. And they could also add um, a new thing like or um, they could add um, like new sabotages to the map. And yeah, so I was just thinking of something underground would be cool. Because right now we have um, on the surface of a planet, in the sky, and in space. So underground would be another cool add-on. But yeah, so it would be cool. And any map would, other map would be cool also. 
Now, the next thing that they could add is a new, um, like, um, what would you call it? Uh, like, a new watching system. Like, you know how there's admin and security and vitals and the communication, um, thing in Myra? So, like, they could add a new one, which is a vent monitor. So, you can, like, monitor, um, vents. So, like... If I go into a vent as the imposter, and someone's on the vent monitor, monitor um, they could see um, that I was on that vent. Like, if I attack this person, they might see that I went in this vent or an event in this area to make it a little less overpowered. Um, so, yeah, they could have, like, um, like, just in certain maps, like, maybe on the skilled, and on another map, maybe um, Polis, they'd have the vent monitor. And it would just help the um, crewmates a little bit to find out where the imposter might have killed. So yeah. For the last thing I'd like to see in Among Us is just uh, some small changes. Like... Um, just a bunch of small changes, like I'd like to see, um, like maybe new colors that they could have, like new character customization items, like new hats and, um, skins and stuff, and maybe some new pets, and like, they could also have, right now we have, um, four kill animations, um, so when you die, um, from an imposter, you'll get one of the four animations, and maybe we could have a few more. But yeah, so just a bunch of small stuff and, like, bug fixes, because right now, like, on mobile especially, the Among Us servers don't really run that well. Like, whenever I'm trying to play on mobile, it takes me a few tries, because it kicks me off, so... Now that there's a ton of people playing, they should start working on making um, the servers better. But yeah, so anyways, that'll be the end for this video. Thank you guys all for watching, and I will see you all later. Bye!